What's up, you guys? My name is Mary. I'm with High Priestess Intuition. Welcome, my current subscribers, and welcome, 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 newbies. If you guys are new to my channel and you enjoy my content, you can smash the sub button to be notified for future readings. This is free channel and collective reading for all signs, cats do side to everybody in between. Don't forget the basics. Time is fluid. Energy is fluid. If it doesn't apply, let it fly. Everyone has free, free will. Only take the messages that resonate. Leave the rest. Free general collective reading. All right, so I received another channeling. I hope everybody's doing well. I do, I do, I do here. Okay, so the channel message I received was, um, I heard an Aquarius is about to get such heavy flack, and I heard their business is uh, already already uh, declined and is about to start declining even more. Um, I heard they are a lawyer. They are a lawyer. Um, I heard um, through many series of chain of events, they're about to start, um, they've already gotten huge flack. They're about to start getting more huge flack. Um, I heard they're about to start helping, <clears throat> helping a very serious child custody battle situation. Um, I heard, um, they're going to help behind the scenes, um, children get back with the correct parent. Um, I heard a lot of this has to do with money though. A lot has to do with money because their business has already, um, declined and i heard it will continue to decline it will continue to severely decline until this situation is resolved this aquarius needs to hear this okay i heard it will um, continue to seriously decline until this situation is resolved this aquarius needs to hear it so spiritual download this um I, I think they, this Aquarius is highly intuitive. I think they know their business is going to seriously decline. Their lawyer business is going to seriously decline until the situation is resolved. I think that's why they're going to behind the scenes help this happen. Um, I heard behind the scenes. So however they're about to do it behind the scenes. But um, I, but this is about money. This is really not about ch child's health or welfare because if it was, don't you think they would have done more of an effort to help prevent this to begin with? Um, and that's just the truth. It was about money to, to, to move them, but it has backfired in a huge way. It will continue. Okay, I heard it was about money to move them, but so to transfer custody is what it sounds like. But it is backfired. So really, this is all about money. It's not really about the best interest of the children, because if it was about the best interest of the children, this Aquarius would have never fed into this to begin with and and actually helped. It sounds like they helped this like power play mover to help this happen for money for them to go. But it is boomerang, it has backfired on them. And it doesn't sound like they're making money off this or they're losing money off this. Their, their business, lawyer business, is definitely declining. But I feel there's something behind the scenes here, or there was, is what I'm saying. And this was all about money. It wasn't about really what's in the best interest of the child or children and the best health and safety and welfare of the children, obviously. This was about money, and it still is going to be about money. So people can claim they're doing what's in the best interest of the child and children all day long, but actions speak louder, louder than words. And in this aspect, this is about money. But this Aquarius doesn't want people to know in society and everyday 3D world that it was about money to even move them and about money to help behind the scenes get them back. I heard this Aquarius knows their business is going to keep declining until they help make this right, until they do get them back. And I heard it will. Spiritual download, is it really, it will, it will keep happening. So, but it's not really about the kids here. It's about their pocketbook, which is greedy and selfish as hell, but at least they're going to help make it right. So. Someone sees right through this Aquarius, right through them. And they will continue to see right through them. And many others are about to see right through this Aquarius too. They cloaked their energy very well in the past, but they cannot anymore. Okay, I heard someone sees right through this Aquarius, right through them. So like x-ray vision right through their soul, right through their intentions, right through everything in them, basically. 
It could be you that sees right through this Aquarius or somebody else. Um, how that resonates and applies. But I heard that whoever this is that sees right through their soul and intentions and et cetera, et cetera, et cetera. Now, they did not in the past, but they do now. They do now. Um, most certainly do now. Most certainly do now. Okay, so you most certainly do now, sir, ma'am, if you are the one that sees right through this Aquarius. For some, you could be this greedy-ass, money-hungry Aquarius that apparently is just strictly in it, things for the money. It's, I mean, and they're a lawyer, and they have something to do with kids. So I feel family law or guardian ad litem energy here. How that resonates and uh, applies. I feel either family law or guardian ad litem energy, and I'm just being serious. I didn't hear specifically, but I did hear lawyer, and I did hear... Um, uh, children so it's either guardian ad litem family law or a combination but whoever you are sir ma'am you did not see i heard they cloaked their energy to you very well in the past so they hid their intentions truly from you in the past very well sir ma'am if this resonates for you seeing through this aquarius uh low vibrational lawyer aquarius um but you see right through them now right through them now but they cloaked their energy to you in the past meaning they covered up their true intentions, their true motives. And all this is money. This is money motives, period. Motive, money. Motive was money in the past to move them. Motive, motive is money now to bring them back. And that's just the truth. But bringing them back is creating balance. It uh, sounds like it's going to create balance in the universe. It's about to create huge balance in the universe. It is very unbalanced right now. Very, very, very unbalanced predatory overstepping a boundary energy okay i heard it's very 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 unbalanced very unbalanced right now in the universe some kind of predatory overstepping a boundary boundary energy right now so this aquarius whether they're a guardian ad litem family law or something to do with kids and they're a low vibrational lawyer they help move child or children or well, her children two or two plus children to a home or some or a care home or some some kind of home situation whether it's foster home, another home, whatever, whatever, of some kind of predatory energy and somebody that likes to overstep boundary or boundaries, whether it's a foster home or a private home. How that resonates and applies. But they knew it and they did it for money. But whatever's going on, as far as they thought they were going to make all this money, to put them in this overstepping of inner, um, boundaries, predatory energy, whether it's a foster home or a... Um, private home it's not working out um and i heard it's not going to continue to work out so um and i heard their business lawyer business is going to continue to decline until it gets straightened out and it's very imbalanced in the universe right now because and yeah because they put them in the hands of some kind of predatory overstepping of boundaries energy well yeah that creates a huge ass uh, imbalance in the universe but this person is so money centered and focused that them bringing them back is about to be money centered too. But I heard it's actually going to end up working out because that is what's in the best interest of the kids truly is. Through many series of chain events, there's about to be huge changes here. Huge. The kids will come back through many series of chain of events. Lots of truth is about to be exposed. Someone is about to go to jail. Oh my God. Okay, I heard through many series of chain of events, the, will, the kids will come back. Um, lots of truth is about to come out. And um, someone is about to go to jail. So you plug it in how it resonates. Someone this Aquarius would have least expected, but it's about to happen. Someone this Aquarius would have least expected, but it's about to happen. So, um, and they're about to be so embarrassed because they have publicly supported this person in the past. Very publicly supported them. Okay, so, through many series of chain of events, the, I heard the kids are going to come back. So, they're going to come back to wherever they previously were. Because um, there's some kind of huge ass imbalance in the universe now. But... Because the Aquarius had a hand, this low vibrational ass lawyer had a hand in placing, abusing their power and placing them in a predatory, overstepping a boundaries energy. When it doesn't sound like they were in the past. Um, but um, 
I heard somebody this Aquarius publicly supports. So this Aquarius very publicly supports somebody very publicly. I heard through many series of chain of events, the person they very publicly support, they're about to go to jail. And I heard it's about to embarrass the hell out of this Aquarius. But it's because this Aquarius is all about public image. They do shifty ass sneaky things behind the scenes. And they don't, oh God forbid, they don't want to be caught or exposed for that. God forbid. But they want their public image to be snack, snack food tight. It's about to backfire on them in such a huge way. Okay, I heard it's about to backfire on them in such a huge way. So it's about to backfire on them in such a huge way because they want their public image to be so taunt, so sneaky clean, so, oh, beautiful, beautiful, beautiful. But they don't actually do what they're, they, you can't expect your public image to be squeaky clean, like Mr. Clean shit. If you're doing shit behind the scenes, like, Free willingly, knowingly placing children in toxic environments um, where people overstep boundaries with predatory energy for money. Everybody needs to hear that. But whoever this person is that's about to go to jail, it's not this low vibrational lawyer or Aquarius, it's somebody else. But it's somebody they very, very, very publicly support now, and their ass is about to go to jail. So you plug it in how it resonates. This is about to turn into a huge public thing. A very huge public thing. But balance is about to be restored. Okay, I heard this is about to turn into a very, very, very huge public thing. A very huge public thing, but balance is about to be restored. So this is about to, I think this person is about to go to jail. The kid's about to come back. And um, the series of chain of events is about to be created to bring kids back now. Whatever series of chain of events, I'm assuming a, a court order, I'm assuming, is probably going to have to be had there. Some kind of legal court order or CPS involvement, removing the children and placing them in the correct home, or a court order or police involvement to, to transport them to the correct home. Or, I mean, I'm feeling court order. I didn't hear court order, but I'm, somehow court order is going to have to eventually come into play with that, is what I'm saying. Whether police get involved initially. CPS gets involved initially, they both get involved initially, or a court order just comes and they just transport back. How that resonates and applies. But I heard this is about to turn into a very, very, very public thing. And it's going to bear the hell out of the squares. Well, they need to choose their connects more wisely. And that's just the truth, because they're a grown-ass person. I'm not even going to call them a friend, because they should be a friend. They should be a connection, a professional connection. I'm 39 years old. I, I don't have damn friends, and that's just the truth. I'm too old for that shit. All right, I love you guys. Everybody have a wonderful day, and namaste.